The coordinator of the Pakarima Mountain Safari, Frank Wilson, says the 2013 edition of the event was successful despite the challenges. The 539-mile journey is usually held between March and April before the Easter celebrations and take the group through the rough mountain terrain and dry savanna lands of Guyana's interior. According to Wilson, the event continues to grow in terms of the number of participants. We had a lot of challenges, which is a total 4x4 four four off-road driving. Uh, we drove like about, a one, let me guys say like about 950 miles from all Georgetown all the way to let him and back. Uh, it was, this year was the largest contingent we have. We have like approximately uh, 25 vehicles. Uh, we, well, as usual on the safari, you have your ups and down vehicle problems. But all, in all that, we made it success, successful. So we're back in let him right now. Wilson said through the Linden to Letham Trail, the safarians forge ahead, stopping at various checkpoints at Kupakari and finally crossing the short ferry trip on the edge of the Irokrama Rainforest Conservation Area. The first major stop was at Karasabai on the first night, and participants slept under the stars in their self-made camps or swinging in their hammocks. This was the first time the safari reached Letham, Wilson explained. Because we're trying to assist by bringing people into Letham, but um, the private sector and the public sector, we have to come more closer and work together, and in the future it could be better. He said one of the main aims of the safari is to woo tourists to the country, but he said the challenges with international airlift to Guyana are affecting arrivals. Tourists is a seasonal business in Guyana, really, which we look at the summertime. But uh, as our problem is to get more people into Guyana, for it to be productive, but the only problem is you see the airlines there, like for example, Delta is pulling out. So we need more air carriers that can bring more people in, so the tourism industry can be more successful. Over the years, the promotion of adventure tourism in Guyana has gained momentum in an effort to attract more visitors to experience Guyana's eco-tourism product. Leroy Adolphus, Capital News.